The First Book of Chronicles Chapter 1 Adam, Seth, Enosh, Kenan, Mahalalel, Jared, Enoch, Methuselah, Lamech, Noah, Shem, Ham, and Japheth. The sons of Japheth were Gomer, Magog, Madai, Javan, Tubal, Meshech, and Tyrus. The sons of Gomer were Ashkenaz, Ripheth, and Togarma. The sons of Javan were Elisha, Tarshish, the Kittim, and the Rodanim. The sons of Ham were Cush, Mizraim, Put, and Canaan. The sons of Cush were Seba, Havilah, Sabta, Rehama, and Sabteca. The sons of Rehama were Sheba and Dedan. Cush became the father of Nimrod, who was the first to be a warrior on the earth. Mizraim became the father of the Ludim, Anamim, Lahabim, Naphtahim, Pathrusim, Caslahim, and Kaphtarim, from whom the Philistines sprang. Canaan became the father of Sidon, his firstborn, and Heth, and the Jebusites, the Amorites, the Girgashites, the Hivites, the Archites, the Sinites, the Arvidites, the Zemurites, and the Hamathites. The sons of Shem were Elam, Asher, Arpachshad, Lud, and Aram. The sons of Aram were Uz, Hal, Gether, and Mash. Arpachshad became the father of Shelah, and Shelah became the father of Eber. Two sons were born to Eber. The first was named Peleg, for in his time the world was divided, and his brother was named Joktan. Joktan became the father of Almodad, Shelah, Hazer Maveth, Jira, Hadoram, Uzal, Dikla, Ebel, Abimiel, Sheba, Ophir, Havilah, and Jobab. All these were the sons of Joktan. Shem, Arpachshad, Shela, Eber, Peleg, Reu, Sirug, Nahor, Terah, Abram, that is, Abraham. The sons of Abraham were Isaac and Ishmael. These were their generations. Nebaioth, the firstborn of Ishmael, then Keter, Adbeel, Mibsam, Mishma, Duma, Mesa, Hadad, Tima, Jeter, Naphish, and Kedema. These were the sons of Ishmael, the sons of Keturah, Abraham's concubine. She bore Zimran, Jokshan, Medan, Midian, Ishbak, and Shua. The sons of Jokshan were Sheba and Dedan. The sons of Midian were Ephah, Ephur, Hanak, Abida, and Aldea. All these were the sons of Keturah. Abraham begot Isaac. The sons of Isaac were Esau and Israel. The descendants of Esau were Eliphaz, Ruel, Jeish, Jalem, and Korah. The descendants of Eliphaz were Teman, Omar, Zephi, Gadam, Kenaz, Timnah, and Amalek. The descendants of Ruel were Naath, Zerah, Shammah, and Mizah. The sons of Seir were Lotan, Shobal, Zibion, Ana, Dishan, Ezer, and Dishan. The sons of Lotan were Horai and Homan. Timnah was the sister of Lotan. The sons of Shobal were Alian, Manahath, Ebal, Shephi, and Onam. The sons of Zibion were Ea and Ana. The sons of Ana, Dishan. The sons of Dishan were Hemdan, Eshban, Ithran, and Kiran. The sons of Ezer were Bilhan, Zeavan, and Jaakin. The sons of Dishan were Uz and Aaron. The kings who reigned in the land of Edom before the Israelites had kings were the following. Bela, son of Beor, the name of whose city was Dinabah. When Bela died, Jobab, son of Zerah, from Borza, succeeded him as king. When Jobab died, Husham, from the land of the Temanites, succeeded him as king. Husham died, and Hadad, son of Bedad, succeeded him as king. He overthrew the Midianites on the Moabite plateau, and the name of his city was Abath. Hadad died, and Samla of Mazraka succeeded him as king. Samla died, and Shal from Rehoboth on the Euphrates succeeded him as king. When Shal died, Baal Hanan, son of Akbor, succeeded him as king. Baal Hanan died, and Hadad succeeded him as king. The name of his city was Pi, and his wife's name was Mehedabal. She was the daughter of Matred, who was the daughter of Mizahab. After Hadad died, there were chiefs in Edom. 
the chiefs of Timnah, Alia, Jetheth, Oholabama, Elah, Pinan, Kenaz, Teman, Mibzar, Magdiel, and Iram were the chiefs of Edom. Chapter 2 These were the sons of Israel, Reuben, Simeon, Levi, Judah, Issachar, Zebulun, Dan, Joseph, Benjamin, Naphtali, Gad, and Asher. The sons of Judah were Ur, Onan, and Shelah. These three Bathshua, a Canaanite woman, bore to him. But Judah's firstborn, Ur, was wicked in the sight of the Lord, so he took his life. Judah's daughter-in-law Tamar bore him Perez and Zerah, so that he had five sons in all. The sons of Perez were Hezron and Hamel. The sons of Zerah were Zimri, Ethan, Heman, Calcol, and Derda, five in all. The sons of Zimri, Carmi. The sons of Carmi, Achar, who brought trouble upon Israel by violating the ban. The sons of Ethan, Azariah, the sons born to Hezron were Jeramiel, Ram, and Kelubai. Ram became the father of Amminadab, and Amminadab became the father of Nashon, a prince of the Judahites. Nashon became the father of Salma. Salma became the father of Boaz. Boaz became the father of Obed. Obed became the father of Jesse. Jesse became the father of Eliab, his firstborn, of Abinadab, the second son, Shimea, the third, Nathanael, the fourth, Radai the fifth, Ozan the sixth, and David the seventh. Their sisters were Zeruiah and Abigail. Zeruiah had three sons, Abishai, Joab, and Asahel. Abigail bore Amasa, whose father was Jether, the Ishmaelite. By his wife Azubah, Caleb, son of Hezron, became the father of a daughter, Jeriath. Her sons were Jeshur, Shobab, and Arden. When Azubah died, Caleb married Ephrath, who bore him Hur. Hur became the father of Uri, and Uri became the father of Bezalel. Then Hezron had relations with the daughter of Maker, the father of Gilead, whom he married when he was sixty years old. She bore him Segub. Segub became the father of Jair, who possessed twenty-three cities in the land of Gilead. Geshur and Aram took from them the villages of Jair, that is, Kenath and its towns, sixty cities in all which had belonged to the sons of Maker, the father of Gilead. After the death of Hezron, Caleb had relations with Ephrathah, the widow of his father Hezron, and she bore him Asher, the father of Tekoa. The sons of Jeramiel, the firstborn of Hezron, were Ram, the firstborn, then Buna, Oren, and Ozum, his brothers. Jeramiel also had another wife, named Adara, who was the mother of Onam. The sons of Ram, the firstborn of Jeramiel, were Maaz, Jamin and Eker. The sons of Onam were Shammai and Jada. The sons of Shammai were Nadab and Abishur. Abishur's wife, who was named Abihail, bore him Abin and Molid. The sons of Nadab were Selid and Apaim. Selid died childless. The sons of Apaim, Ishai. The sons of Ishai, Shishan. The sons of Shishan, Alai. The sons of Jada, the brother of Shammai, were Jether and Jonathan. Jether died childless. The sons of Jonathan were Peleth and Zaza. These were the sons of Jeramiel. Shishan had no sons, only daughters. He had an Egyptian slave named Jarha. Shishan gave his daughter in marriage to his slave Jarha, and she bore him Atai. Atai became the father of Nathan. Nathan became the father of Zabad. Zabad became the father of Ephlal. Ephlal became the father of Obed. Obed became the father of Jehu. Jehu became the father of Azariah. Azariah became the father of Helez. Helez became the father of Eliasa. Eliasa became the father of Sismai. Sismai became the father of Shalom. Shalom became the father of Jechemiah. Jechemiah became the father of Elishema. The sons of Caleb, the brother of Jeremiel. Misha, his firstborn, who was the father of Ziph. Then the sons of Marisha, who was the father of Hebron. The sons of Hebron were Korah, 
Tapua, Recham, and Shema. Shema became the father of Raim, who was the father of Jorkiam. Recham became the father of Shammai, the son of Shammai, Maan, who was the father of Bethzer. Epha, Caleb's concubine, bore Haran, Moza, and Gazes. Haran became the father of Gazes. The sons of Jadai were Regum, Jotham, Geshen, Pelet, Epha, and Sheath. Maacah, Caleb's concubine, bore Sheber and Terhana. She also bore Seif, the father of Madmana, Shiva, the father of Machbena, and the father of Gibeah. Aksa was Caleb's daughter. These were sons of Caleb, sons of Hur, the firstborn of Ephrathah, Shobal, the father of Kiriath Jerim, Salma, the father of Bethlehem, and Hareph, the father of Beth Gader. The sons of Shobal, the father of Kiriath Jerim, were Rhea, half of the Manahathites, and the clans of Kiriath Jerim, the Ithrites, the Puthites, the Shumathites, and the Mishraites. From these, the Zorahites and the Eshtaolites derived. The sons of Salma were Bethlehem, the Natophathites, Atroth Beth Joab, half of the Manahathites, and the Zorites. The clans of the Sophrim dwelling in Jabez were the Tyrathites, the Shimeathites, and the Sukathites. They were the Kenites who descended from Hamath, the ancestor of the Rechabites.